So uh, here's the biggest piece I found today. So uh, it's not exactly all of today's finds. Um, this ends up making it all of today's finds. So uh, yeah, what I'm doing is uh, trying to clean some of the uh, algae off that's pretty uh, stubborn on the rock. So, being quartz, it's uh, seven on the Mohs hardness scale. It's pretty hard stuff. So people are like, "Well, are you scratching it all up with that little uh, metal pick there?" But it's not too bad on it at all, really. Again, it's uh, quartz is pretty hard stuff. So, so yeah, this was the biggest piece again that was found. So. And uh, it's a nice piece. So just wanted to share with the audience a little bit of what I do off camera, trying to get all this uh, gunk off, this biomatter off of uh, and dirt off of the specimen to make it look more presentable, nicer. And uh, yeah, all this right here that I'm scraping is. Uh, is algae. It's like that. It's a desert algae that lives under the uh, under the rocks, out of the direct UV sunlight, and uh, that's where it propagates and uh, survives, and where it can be found underneath the rocks. So. Toothbrush here. Like that. Yeah, getting better. Getting better. Uh, try to get as much of it off as I can. Over time, it dries off in the sunlight and flakes away when it's exposed to the sun's rays. So, A lot of it is uh, is not algae. It'll be uh, manganese oxide stains or iron oxide stains build up or whatever. Like right here, looks like an iron oxide chunk right here that's not coming off. It's part of the rock, the way the rock was uh, made in hydrothermal action. So, yeah. Yeah, looking better than it was when I found it, that's for sure. See all chunks of iron here, oxide. And there she is, pretty much. Biggest piece I found today. Thanks for uh, watching. Uh, this part of the video on the cleanup. I would like to thank everybody again, as I always do at the end of my rock hunting videos, thanking all of you for joining me and watching this video. So, when you get out there and you rock hunt, as I do, as always, watch where you walk, how you walk, make sure you have the proper gear, clothing, etc., water. Like in my environment, being a desert environment, always bring lots of water. And I wish all of you to be happy, healthy, and safe. Take care. See you on the next rock hunt.